happening? Lee Jones here from Jones 101, back with another YouTube video. As you can see on the table in front of me, I'm going to be reviewing all of these boots. Big shout out to Nike Football, who we are very lucky to be sponsored by. Just before you watch this video, make sure that you hit that subscribe button and hit the bell so you get notified when we do new videos. As you can see guys, I have been wearing some of these boots in the coaching and also to training. These are still pretty fresh, haven't worn these yet. These are my go-to at the minute, the low top Mercurials, honestly, one of my favorite boots. We'll leave it for the video to decide. And again, I've still only worn these once. Uh, guys, make sure you watch the full video on what I really think of these boots. I'm gonna go into detail on basically what position these suit best as well. I mean, obviously it's all down to you what boots you wanna wear, but let's see how I got on with these boots. Let's go. Right, so I'm trying to put the mercurials on and um, does anyone else have this problem? I just, I'm struggling here, but when they're on my feet, I can't get them on. When they're on my feet, they're like a glove. However, it does take me a long time to put them on. 2,000 years later. <laughs> Get one. Right there, right there. Right there. Yes. Oh. Wow. So, no banner, that was very hard to put on, but when I finally slide my foot in, it's like a glove. So guys, just to conclude on the vapors, I've got the low top ones here and I've got the superfly ones. I think in the video, I wore the superfly. Honestly, my personal opinion, these are one of my favorite boots right now. As you can see, I've got a lot of wear out of these. I use these a lot for coaching. My favorite thing about these boots, guys, is they're just incredibly light, but I also really like the look of these boots. The, the light blue, you can see a lot of pros wearing them at the minute in the Premier League. Honestly, I really like the detail that's at the bottom of the boot as well. As you as you wear them though, they do tend to the, the shine on the bottom does go. So for me, guys, I'm going to give these a solid nine out of ten. They they're very hard to get on your feet, but as soon as they're on your feet, I really like that preference of it just really like sucking onto your foot. It's it's beautiful. It really feels like you're not wearing any boots. One of the best boots for me at the minute, um, as you can see in the speed and agility. They're just super light. I feel like I'm a fast player and I'm very, very slow. So I'm gonna now move on to the Phantom VNM. Let's give these a try. These are delish. Let's go. Oh, they're still fresh, guys, you can see. Still got the, uh, still got all the stuff in them. Guys, for me, these are my favorite. Um, again, I'll do the boot review in the house, but let's put these to the test. The Venoms, these are a striker's boot. What I really want to see, just whilst the boots are fresh, Baz, they have these grooves on the right-hand side for the right foot and the left-hand side for the left foot. These grooves, um, which apparently, they went into grave detail with these. Um, these apparently replicate what is known as the grooves in a golf club. 
Um, so I spoke to um, Nick from Nike on how they made these boots and it's actually incredible the detail that they've gone into. These are there for you to generate more spin, more finesse, more control on your shots. Um, and I've, I've used these before guys because I've had the red boots before. These for me, this is a big shout, but these are one of my favorite boots of all time. I actually love them. I don't know if you can see that Baz, but they've gone into a lot of detail there. Uh, they have the Just Do It on there. They have the condition control, a little mic sign. So I really like the detail that they've gone into on the side of the boot as well. They even have Nike football, like little quotes in here as well on the side. I don't know if you can see that. So I really like the detail there. Um, and the bottom of the boot as well. The back four are really good for changing direction, which really grip into the ground. And then as you can see, there's a lot of detail in the front there as well. Um, but for me, again, this is a striker's boot. I think Harry Kane wears these. Who else wears these? Raheem Sterling wears these. Um, so let's see. Let's take them for eight strike. Guys, the first thing I'm going to do is just assess like the finesse and the curl. So I'm just going to give them a try on the finesse, the feel, and really get these grooves into action on my strong foot. Three bad. Oh, straight away, guys. It's yeah, I can see, I can feel it. I love it, I love them, they're just... Oh, between these and the... I don't know, they're all good, Baz. Oh, they feel so good. I hit that one right on there as well, guys. Right on that part of the booth. Let's hit three more. I'm just gonna go for that far post every time with a bit of finesse on it. So that one there, I just caught the ground first so I lost a lot of spin. Oh, that whistle. Guys, this is how you do it with the TM Brothers. <laughs> Guys, I'm just missing the target right, but you can really see the amount of curl I'm getting on it there, Baza. I think that is definitely the grooves of the boot. Gives that extra bit of spin. I can really feel it as well. So I've done the finesse shot. Let's see what they're like putting laces through the ball. Let's see what they feel like with that. Guys, yeah, done on the laces, uh, pretty much. <laughs> uh, guys, not gonna lie, that was my first take on my laces. I'm gonna leave it there. Uh, big thing about the laces is I really like the sock. They have this stretchy under sock on the boot. Again, and here as well, it goes down, which covers the laces, but that is a nice feel. So when I ping that one there, top bins, it felt beautiful. I'm not gonna hit another one, guys. I'm gonna leave it there. I'm gonna move on to volleys. Let's see what they're like with the volleys. Again, my guess is very similar to what I've just done with laces, but obviously a little bit different. Let's just see what the feel is like. Ready, Johnny? Johnny's just standing in goal, by the way, guys. He's not really trying. Yeah, they feel amazing. If you get that speed through the ball, if you get that speed through the ball, you can get good dip. Again, I'm going with full force. I'm just testing the feel of the boots, you know? Oh, you can see the ball starting to dip. Let's take three more. Yes guys, about to try on the uh, the visions. As you can see, absolutely delicious, but I think I'm gonna have the same problem as the Mercurials. I'm getting them on my feet, so we'll give them a cracker. Guys, love the little touch that they do here just with the laces. You just slide it off ledge always about the little details just want to talk about the sole of these boots just before i start training on the synthetic and it gets all black i really like the look of the sole really clean um i really like the look of the studs really professional as you can see different shapes different sizes really thick at the bottom but for me the look of the bottom of these boots 
Yes, guys, after 45 minutes of trying to get these boots on, it's actually worth it. Wow. Can you even get the focus on them, Baz? It's, nah. They're so bright. They're actually hurting my eyes when the sun shines on them. Guys, I've already been through the bottom of the boots. Now that I've got them on, wow. To, I'll be honest with you guys, I'll do the boot review at the end in the office, but my favorite are the VNMs. But I tell you what, now that I've put these on and I feel how nice, how comfortable they are, and the look of them are delicious as well. That's put me in two minds, Jordy. I don't know which ones are my favorite boots, but let's put these to the test. These are definitely a midfielder's boot. I think Kevin De Bruyne wears these. Um, the first thing, guys, is they're just like, it's like they've glued to my feet. They feel so good, so comfy, and they're so light. Again, it doesn't feel like I've got a pair of boots on. What we're gonna do, though, we're gonna test the touch, test the ball striking. We're gonna do a couple of through balls with these. Let's see how they go. Great ball, Johnny. Honestly, that's, that's my first three in a row, Baz, yeah? Yeah. That's no legit, no no editing there. Because they're so tight to your feet, this, for me, it does help your touch. I can feel it. The feel on the touch is delicious. Like, Jasper's firing them in. I think that's the first time I've called him Jasper. Johnny, Tony, two-step has fired that in, and I'm, oh, let's do a few more. Jasper, them balls were delicious, you know? Oh, look, it's just, yeah, great ball. Look at that. Yeah. Oh my god, This has definitely put a doubt in my mind as to which ones are actually my favourite. What we'll do now, guys, we're going to test the ping. Um, but just in terms of touch, the second that ball hits your foot, you can really feel it. It helps with your first touch to be a little bit softer with the ball. Johnny, can you just go a little bit further back? We're going to ping in and uh, we'll assess. But I haven't hit any yet, but I'm telling you, now, I know they're going to be good because of the feel and how light they are. Ready, Jeff? First goal, don't move, Johnny. Unbelievable, it feels so good. Yes, Jeff? Yeah, great ball, you. Same again. Oh, guys. Don't Jeff. Guys, they're so nice. Oh, great ball, Johnny, lad. Go left foot. Bad. Guys, I really like them. Um, oh, I'll do the review in the house, but oh, they're so good. They put that in my mind. Guys, if you buy these, they grip to your feet. Like, the, I think the sock inside of them just grips your feet. It honestly, took me about 25 minutes to get them on, but they feel so good. Touch and strike, and I love them. Now guys, don't get me wrong, you can wear bricks on your feet, it's all about the player that wears the boots, don't get me wrong, but I do feel like Nike have gone out of their way to really tailor a boot towards a specific position, um, and these are definitely a midfielder boot. I feel like again, because the ball's striking and the touch and the feel is good, they're great for through balls. Now, let me clarify, you could have bricks on your feet and still play good through balls, okay? But I'm going to try and just hit a good... A few weight passes, weighted passes to Johnny, and then he's going to try and go on and finish. Johnny, I'm just going to slide you in there in between the left back. Yes, go. Top speed, you. Yeah, yeah. Spin, Johnny. Great touch. Finish, Johnny. Finish. <laughs> Oi, two more, Johnny. Get this one. Yes. Go, Johnny. Go, Johnny. Oh, great touch, Johnny. Finish. <laughs> Guy, <laughs> that's why he's a goalkeeper. Great ball though. Ready? Yes, go. Go, Johnny. <laughs> finish, Johnny. Guys, ignore his touch and finish, but the through ball, delicious. First of all, just want to say, Johnny, great finishing. <laughs> so guys, that's a video. It took me a long time to do this one. Obviously, I've done three boot reviews in one video. I'm just going to go through what I think is the best boot, in order, 3, 2, 1, very difficult, but in third, I'm going to go with, I can't do it, I, I don't know what I'm going to go with, uh, so guys, in third, I'm not going to lie, it's going to be very hard to do this, but I'm going to go with the divisions, 
just because it's as as a player this is my preference although they are an incredible boot great for midfielders as soon as you put them on your feet it's like you're not even wearing boots for that light the feel of these are incredible uh, especially with the sock i love the detail of the sock i really love the detail at the bottom of the boots um, and the look is absolutely brilliant but for me i'm going to put these in third that's because it's my own preference um, but again there's a lot of players wearing these in the premier league i absolutely love them i will be wearing them this year 100 percent i'll flick from the three but in third i'm going to go that one right second place oh Guys, this is too hard, but I'm gonna go with gonna go with the vapors, even though I've been wearing them a lot for coaching lately. Um, this is very, very hard choice, but these are one of the best vapors for me. I love these and the blackouts as well, which we've got a, a pair of the, the blackouts. But the color of these are just absolutely delicious. I love the detail at the bottom. I love the shine. When you again, these took me about an hour to put on my feet, but as soon as I put them on, they just glue to your feet. Lovely feel when you're doing um, like ball striking, passing, shooting, and these are great for wingers because they're obviously ridiculously light, good for speed, even though I'm slow. Um, so, in a close second, are the Vapors or the Superflies, and then that obviously leaves me number one. Again, this is just because it's my preference. For me, I absolutely love these boots. Um, I've started to wear them a little bit more now. I just really love the detail on the side of the boot, which a big part of my game is like whipping crosses in and free kicks and stuff. So I feel like the, the grooves on the side here really generate mad crazy spin. The look is incredible. So for me guys, yeah, I'm putting these as number one. And also I'm gonna put them in my top five boots ever really. I absolutely love them. Hey, that's the video guys. If you got this far, comment down below. Comment Jonah if you got this far. If you didn't, you probably already clicked away by now. Make sure you subscribe and I'll see you on the next video. Peace.